So you have a new DaVinci Resolve database and you want to get your old power bins moved over so you don't waste time importing them into every single project. Just create a new empty project in the database that has your favorite power bins, select your master power bin folder, and copy and paste those into the regular bins up top. This will be a transfer project, so go to File, Export Project. Then hop over to the other database you'd love to have these power bins in and right click to import that transfer project. Now open that project up in the new database and all that's left to do is drag your regular bins down to the power bin section and you're done with all your organization intact. But if you're confused about what the heck a power bin is to begin with, give me one more minute to explain. Power bins are visible if you go to the view menu and show power bins. They're like regular bins, but they're visible in every project, both old and new, in the same DaVinci Resolve database. They're perfect for common assets you might need to reuse, so you're not wasting time doing a copy and paste between projects or importing from disk every time that you need them. However, they still point to a single file on a hard drive. They're not embedded into the database, in other words, so I suggest you put them on a permanently attached disk. I put mine on the internal drive, and these are some of the assets I put in there for reuse. The main limitation is you can't drag timelines, multicam clips, or compound clips into a power bin. I would use a handy timeline DRT file or bin file for those. Hey, I'm Chadwick, this is Creative Video Tips. Thank you so much for watching, and because there's so much more to learn, I'll see you in that next video.